Tom and Betty grew to love MU's College of Veterinary Medicine while they were students. They owned a basset hound named Smiley, and unfortunately, Smiley suffered a broken back. Tom and Betty brought her to the college's teaching hospital for treatment. At that time, there was little that could be done for dogs with back injuries, but the Scots were so impressed with the care Smiley received and the kindness of the faculty that they promised to someday repay the college. Tom and Betty remain animal lovers. They are the proud parents of two toy poodles, Rags and Nicole. Betty is an avid horsewoman. As I mentioned, the Scotch pledged to acknowledge the work of MU's College of Veterinary Medicine many years ago. They have been very generous over the years, and now they are making a greater commitment to the future of the College of Veterinary Medicine. I can't think of a better way to kick off a new year than to honor very distinguished alums of this university, and particularly people like Tom and Betty Scott, who have been so generous to the academic mission of this university, and who have given of themselves in so many ways, and in this particular way, uh, to ensure the continued health and well-being of animals and the contributions that research and scholarship in that area uh, gives to all of medical science generally. And it's my pleasure this morning to announce that the Scots have made a gift of $2 million to the MU College of Veterinary Medicine. I appreciate uh, the comments that were made a moment ago about Smiley, our first pet for four-legged pet that we came down and although uh, the vet school tried tremendously, the staff, the students, everyone worked very, very hard to save Smiley, but it couldn't come to pass. And at that time, uh, very candidly, all we could do was afford to pay the bill. But uh, we told the school at that time, hopefully someday we could do more for Smiley they just pay her bill. I hope today is that day. <coughs> so we're delighted to be able to do and make the gift that we are. In life, there are some things that are just understood. For instance, if you're talking about veterinary oncology at UMC, you're talking about the Scott Endowment. If you're talking about Tom and Betty's kids, you're talking about Rags and Nicole. And if you're talking about the pursuit of excellence, you're talking about Tom and Betty Scott. Thank you for everything you've done for us. Tom and Betty, we recognize this gift represents an extraordinary investment in MU, an unprecedented level of faith and confidence in the leadership of the college and university. As interim dean, I can reaffirm that your investment will absolutely make a difference by importantly providing flexibility for future deans to address those greatest needs, opportunities, and strategic priorities of the college. In short, your gift will allow a level of responsiveness to future needs which will uniquely position our college to build on its legacy of excellence. Tom and Betty, your gift elevates you to the highest level of Jefferson Club membership, the ambassador level. Chancellor Deaton, would you help me with this presentation? Thank you. Tom. At this time, the college would like to make a small presentation. Lauren Bacon is going to bring forth our gift. Oh, my goodness. Oh. Something Rags and Nicole it, can also it's appreciate. It's a <laughs> can, can you all say this? It's hysterical. Martini glasses? Paw printed martini glasses? They're from Mother. <laughs> I think one comment I'd like to make about the situation with the, the girls, the babies, the children, is if I come back as a dog, you know where I'm going to ask to be placed. Same place. We'd be glad to have you. 